revealing of a homicide investigation. A man punched in the head outside of Providence nightclub has died. Charles Betancourt died Saturday afternoon, hours after he was found unconscious in a parking lot. Tonight, police say they're searching for his killer. Eyewitness News reporter Mara Kennedy joins us now live in the capital city with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Mike and Susan, this is a very sad story. I sat down with the family of Charles Benincourt. They told me that he was in the Army for a year. He was also a fisherman in New Bedford. Tonight, they're looking for answers after he died. A New Bedford family gathers around the table, sharing memories and looking through photos of 21-year-old Charles Benincourt. Always asking if he could help. Like everybody. The family tells Eyewitness News they decided to take their son and brother off of life support after he was punched in the head outside a nightclub in downtown Providence Friday morning. This guy just comes from behind him that was not even involved in anything like going on, not even talking to them and just decided to just sucker punch him in the back of the head, knocked him unconscious and he hit his head on the floor. The family tells us Ben and Cord didn't know the suspect at all. The 21-year-old New Bedford man was at the club with his friends, and about two days later, his family made the hard decision to take him off life support. It feels like the same day that's never ended, and well, it's just pure disregard for human life. The wake for Charles Bedicourt is Wednesday at Boulevard Funeral Home from 4 to 8 at night, and the mass is Thursday morning at 11 o'clock at St. Anthony's. Reporting live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Mara Kennedy, Eyewitness News.